Trust Flash and Trust TV, still full of energy, still buzzing and pretty setting, you're not tired either. We have a few more segments to go just before we wrap things up and this particular one is one I absolutely love and enjoy. Now, we're doing things a little differently today because uh, we pulled up on somebody's birthday a couple of days ago. We decided to cover it up and bring it to you. I mean, birthdays are definitely one of the most special days of people's lives and I mean, it always is amazing when you are able to relieve those moments and that's exactly what we're, going to, what we're going to do here. We're going to play it because we had to, you know, we had the honors of covering it or we'll play it. and I'm pretty certain the person would have, would have a good time relieving those special moments right here on Trust Flash. Let's go check out how it went down, check out some of the biggest highlights and when we come back, then we move over to the next. The reason for this gathering today, we are celebrating my bishop, Dr. Bishop John Oche Ega. That is the reason why we gather here today to celebrate my father, my mentor, my coach. A man that has given me opportunity, a platform to minister under this great commission. My father is a man with a golden heart, a man with a loving heart, a man with a caring heart. He's a mentor, he's a coach, he's a teacher. I want to say that from the day I met with this man, my life changed. My life turned around. The day I encountered him and this great commission, my life changed. I want to say a word to my father. Daddy, I love you. I love you so much. I am short of words to use, but all I have to say is I love you so much. And I pray that as you celebrate this, your new age, may the Almighty God bless you, increase you abundantly. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Works, I cannot describe him in one word because he's not just a daddy to me, he's our bishop, he's our overseer, he's a mentor, he's a great man of God that is concerned about the salvation of souls. What he is doing is beyond just saving souls, he's also building families, building, you know, mentoring people. And I pray God will continue to empower him and bless, give him more blessed years. Increase his years, we shall celebrate him. In the next 50 years, we'll still be celebrating him. We'll stand here to celebrate him. And the unction upon his head will continue to increase as he grows old. He's a very kind man, um, we are happy, as you can see what is going on here, we are so happy, we are blessed to have him as a father, as our father, and what you see happening here is happening all over the world, and we are here to say, Daddy, we love you, you will live long in good health, in the mighty name of Jesus. HPMC Abuja Kagini, we say we love you, Papa, happy birthday, sir. Happy
Thank God I look like <laughs> Hallelujah. I'm going to call the king on behalf of the bishop. I am happy to witness his birthday and also this month is also my birthday so I am overwhelmed by his own birthday. We celebrated him because he's our father and also our mentor and he, anyone that comes closer to him, his life will not remain the same because he's a true, he, he's a man of God. Oh, I must say that since I joined this church, Papa has been a wonderful man to us. In fact, I've learned a lot of, I've learned a lot of things from me. From me. He's my mentor, he's a role model. I'm celebrating him today. May God bless him in Jesus' name. I'm here to give God the glory upon Papa's life. Papa has been a great father to us. Since the very first day I set I stepped my eyes on Papa, it was also. I'm celebrating Papa because he is our spiritual mentor. I've not seen a daddy like this. Daddy that knows the heart of his children. Daddy that knows how to comfort his children. Daddy that prays for his children. But daddy, I love you so much. I don't know how to express my love for you. All I need to say, all I have to say is, I love you, Papa. We are here to thank God for your life. We appreciate God and we appreciate you for the days that God had another year to your year. We wish you long life and prosperity. Amen. More grace, more anointing in the name of Jesus. Amen. More all years. Oh, yes. Your God Amen. increase your ministry. Yes. This is a widow that puts money on our face yes. last year. He came here to celebrate you. And we were stand here on behalf of widow. Some of them are outside and eat. Oh, you are enjoying yourself. Happy birthday to you. We love you. We love you so much. And we pray for you more progress in the name of Jesus. Take our greeting to Mama. We love Mama. Lord, you more anointing for everything. The Lord is your name. And we wish you happy birthday. We shall see you again in the name of Jesus. Let's see to Papa. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, happy birthday, happy birthday to you. Hooray! Papa is a wonderful man. In fact, he's a lover of everybody. He's a friend of all. He's a father that loves at all times notwithstanding the situation. I must say, he, he is truly called by God. And from my experience with him, from encounter I've had with him, I will say that he, this is the best place to be. With Bishop Dr. John Egger, I will repeat it that this is the best place to be because he's a role model. On this day, I wish him long life. I wish him prosperity. And I pray that God will grant all his desires. And I will say that I wish him long life I pray that no man will cast an evil spell on him and he will live long and see his first, second, third and fourth generation in Jesus' name.
Alright, there it is. I mean, if you have a birthday, you'd probably like us to cover it up and bring it on TV. You probably would want to reach out and we may consider, we may call you back, alright? In the meantime, big shout out and big happy birthday to you out there celebrating and doing a big cheers to more uh, prosperity, of course, and cheers to an absolutely successful next 365. Until next week, when we bring back yet another segment, hopefully we'll uh, be able to go cover somebody else's birthday and bring it on TV, make you a little famous, you get me? In the meantime, it's time for us to move away from that particular segment and wrap the show up with one segment we called Woman Crush. In the meantime, keep it right here on Trust TV. We'll be back in a bit. Welcome back friends and family, it's Trust Flash on Trust TV, Jordan is my name, here to wrap things up on this final segment on the show called Woman Crush. Now on this segment, like the name implies, we bring to the spotlight an absolutely fantastic individual out there doing it real heavily, influencing the world, making an impact and doing it real big. And today we have an absolutely elegant lady off of the Kennywood movie industry, one of our favorites of course, you know her as Miriam Booth. Now we're going to, you know, put her on the spotlight and, you know, dig a little deep into her life and tell you a little more than you know about her, of course. So let's get straight into it. Like I said, it's Mariam Booth. Her full name is Mariam Ado Mohammed. She's also known as Mariam Booth. She was born on October 28, 1993. Pretty young, isn't she? Yes, yeah, she is. She's a Nigerian actress and model. She's best known for her role in the Milkmaid film 2020, which was Nigeria's representative for the best international feature category at the Academy Awards for her role as Zainab in the film. She won the Africa Movie Academy Award for the best actress in a supporting role and a bunch of others. She's absolutely fantastic and we hope that she knows. We right here on Trust TV, we see you, we encourage you, keep doing it real big and keep you know being a role model to young actors and actresses hoping for a flourishing career in the movie industry. Big congratulations and big shout out to you. That's exactly how we end the show today. Big shout out and big congratulations to you for making it through to another month. We've started it pretty big. We've set the bar real high. Cannot wait to get back next week to do it from the scratch and do it even bigger. My name is Jordan. See y'all next week. Peace. <laughs>